Hey everyone, my name is Michelle. I'm a volunteer here at the Colorado Wolf and Wildlife Center and we're doing our weekly wolf blog. Today I'm hanging out with Kenai. Uh, I apologize if this video is a little shaky. I'm kind of holding the camera while we're talking. Um, today I wanted to answer one of the questions that we had and that was how big do wolves get? Now on average, uh, a male wolf weighs just over 100 pounds, so usually about 105 to 110 and a female wolf usually weighs about 75 to 85 pounds. Boys on average are about 10% bigger than most females. Um, the size of a wolf also varies just by their species. Um, the Mexican gray wolves, for example, are the smallest and most genetically distinctive subspecies of gray wolf. Um, Size-wise, they usually only get about 75 pounds for males and about 60 pounds for females. Arctic wolves are usually along the same lines as a timber wolf. They can be a little bit smaller um, or they can be a little bit bigger. Wolves' weights vary individually. You might have larger individuals and then smaller individuals even within the same species or subspecies. Um, so Kenai, he's actually on the smaller end of a timber wolf. Um, for a male, he's only about 95 pounds and he still has a little bit more growing to do um, and we expect him to reach a maturity uh, around about 105 maybe. Um, now Kikoa, who is over here, he actually only weighs um, about 125 pounds. People usually guess him a lot larger. Now the largest wolf on record ever was 175 pounds and they've theorized that this wolf was actually a wolf dog um, rather than a pure wolf. Uh, as wolf dogs sometimes are actually a little bit larger than pure wolves. Now, just recently they did collar a wolf out in Yellowstone National Park. He weighed, um, he was one of the biggest that they had ever weighed. He was about 140 pounds. The largest wolf ever collared in Yellowstone National Park was 147. Now, again, like I said, they vary individually. Uh, a lot of the adult female wolves that they have found out in like Washington and Oregon, for example, are in the 70s. So again, my name is Michelle. I'm a volunteer here at the Colorado Wolf and Wildlife Center, and this was one of our weekly wolf blogs. Please keep our, your questions coming. We're happy to answer them for you. Um, we have a long list now, but we like to have more so we never run out. Thanks, guys. Um, <laughs> here comes Kikoa. Now, Kikoa, he's kind of a big guy, maybe. Um, Kikoa still is well within the average size of a wolf. <laughs> Hi, thank you. Um, so, thank you. Well, you are covered in dirt. Hi, Kenai. Now, it only takes wolves... Uh, oh, gosh. <laughs> and about 60 pounds for girls. Um, now, <laughs> goodness gracious, you guys. Kisses! Uh -huh. Making me, my life hard, guys. Making my life hard hard to make blogs. Um, so they range in size um, just depending on species. Now, thank you. I need to...